This is Jerry Wilson. I'm the Director of Business Development for the Zero POS platform for Adello. In this video, we're going to look at how you can use the Adello Back Office Cloud to add an item to a menu in just three easy steps. Step one is let's select the menu that we're going to add the item. In this case, we're going to use our Fine Dine demo database and we're going to add an item to the uh, appetizer menu. So let's go out to the POS Cloud. This is the dashboard and from here you can use the drop down to go to the menus or you can use the shortcuts on the side here and go straight to the menu section here. We're going to select the Find Dine menu and then the appetizer menu within that. And this is the one we're using. This is the same layout you saw earlier on the screen. Let's say we're going to add a bruschetta. So let's click the button, the button where we're going to add it, go here and now type in bruschetta and there it is in our database. Now that's step two. We've now added the item to the database and step three is simply hit the save button. Now what we've done there is now on the next synchronization to the store that's going to be downloaded to the database at the store level and then the next time the servers access the appetizer menu that button will be available to them. That synchronization generally takes, takes place less than a minute so it's really really fast. But what if the item is not in the menu or not in the database? Well you select the same button, the button that you're going to add and let's say we're going to add a, a new item called Gator Tail. Let's make sure that that's not in the database and it's not. So now we hit New. We're going to add the description. It is a product and now we're going to add the department and the category and the subcategory. Now what we've just done by doing this is we've selected the reporting aspects of it. We've also selected the tax status and the printer routing. If you know the cost, you can enter the cost of that item here, and in this case, we're just going to put in $5. But if you know the cost, you can put that in there, and then we have a profit report that will be available to you as well. I'm also going to select the kitchen prep. This is, it helps with the inventory reporting. I'm going to select the product type, and where on the receipt I'd like it to print, and of course then the price of the item and the minimum markup that I'd like to obtain. Once I have hit the save, it now makes that available to me. There it is. Select the item, hit select, and now we've added that item to the menu. By hitting save, next, the next sync goes down to the database of the store and that item is available to the servers. Using the Adela POS Cloud, makes this a very easy, easy way to address your database from uh, anywhere really on the planet. It's available, Adelo POS Back Office Cloud is available for all Adelo POS platforms. That would be Adelo POS, Adelo Touch, and Zero POS. If you're using a, the Adelo Touch platform, there is no charge for the Adelo back office cloud is, is included and of course you can connect to your database without the need for a remote login software you just simply go to any internet browser use your username and password and you can access your database Adelo back office cloud is available from your local dealer or you may obtain additional information by going to www.adelo.com if you do not know your local dealer Call 800-801-6036 and our inside sales team will help locate your dealer for you.